Tonight, 911 calls telling just one part of an unimaginable survival story. Unreal, a close mm. call for a father, son, and their dog walking away without a scratch after a crash landing in a tree. <laughs> All this happening in Destin. Our Morella Porter joining us now in the studio. Morella, just listening to those calls and seeing the pictures. It is just crazy they were all able to walk away. Yeah, it really is, Byron. After seeing the video and pictures, a lot of people on social media have said God must have been their co-pilot. This is truly something you have to see to believe. And there's a plane that just crashed. You said a plane? Yeah, the plane just crashed. A heart racing 911 call paints the picture of what some have called a miracle. Are there any injuries that you know of? Uh, no, ma'am. A father, son, and their dog safe after crash landing in a tree in a woman's backyard in Destin. It's in the backyard of this house. Okay, and it's only one. It's only one plane. One plane, yes, ma'am. Okaloosa County deputies say the plane was just 10 feet shy of hitting the house. The pilot, 47-year-old Jason Doherty, his 22-year-old son Caleb, and their dog were the only ones on the plane flying to vacation in Destin from their home in Kansas. They stopped to refuel in Fort Smith, Arkansas earlier that morning and still had 22 gallons of fuel when their engine stopped running just as they were getting ready to land at the Destin airport. The pilot calling a mayday as he made what he called a somewhat smooth landing on top of the trees in the backyard of the home that sits near the runway. The pilot telling deputies the plane started sliding slowly on one side once they were on the trees. The left wing resting on the ground, stopping the aircraft from falling completely out of the tree. Is anyone pinned? No, they're just sitting on top trying to get out. The two men and their Labrador retriever helped by neighbors, including the 911 caller who witnessed it all. We've got a ladder to them right now and they're trying to get down. And no damage was reported to the house and there was no fire or smoke coming from the plane, just some spilled fuel. The plane will most likely stay in the tree until it, the NTSB finishes its investigation. In the studio, Morella Porter, Fox 10 News.